Well, hello there, Mr. Pelagoni, and back with another video for my own channel. Um, I'm just making a relatively quick video because I'm not sure that I'm going to be able to do anything for the, the main PAGS channel um, this coming week. It's, I'm very busy now. It's show week. Uh, just starting filming this today on Sunday, the... Oh, what is it? Uh, oh, my calendar, my clocks changed it's the 11th of june sorry my my watch went over to a different face which didn't have a a date on it sorry about that um right I, i'm just sort of as i said i'm looking really at what show plants i've got now for the national show one or two are a bit disappointing one or two are pretty good now i did attend the bristol show uh yesterday um if you're hearing big bangs it's because there's a storm brewing to the east which is coming our way so i'm trying to get this video done before this storm comes across the weather's turned very hot in the uk at the moment thankfully we've lost that awful wind that we've had the cold northeast wind has been replaced by a warm southeast wind now uh but it's bringing some storms up from france so uh, <laughs> i'm uh, i'm just trying to rush this through before the storm comes um, I attended Bristol show yesterday and best in show was this chap. Um, it's Rushmore Jan Wilson, a Steve Pollard plant. Uh, it's a big boy, probably 80, 80 centimetres across. Uh, did very well. Best in show. Am I surprised? A little bit. Um, Bob Clark, who's a really fantastic grower, doesn't do any social media or anything like that, doesn't do computers, I don't think, either. Um, he's a really fantastic angel grower. I have to give credit to him. Uh, but my plant, uh, I suppose, just pipped one or two of his fantastic angels. Um, and so it was really good to kick off the season with a, with a show win. And I have to say that I was a little bit surprised, shall we say. Uh, I've got a few other bits and pieces which are coming on for the show. Um, others uh, are not faring so well. It's the lateness. Um, this is an, always a, a plant that you, I'm usually very successful with at the shows, Gosbrook Susanna. But this year is just blooming so late. I can only blame it really on the on the very cool March and April that we had. Okay, it was sunnier in May, but it wasn't that particularly warm with it. I'm hopeful that this Shriven and Pearl uh, puts out a few more blooms and that'll be fairly decent, I hope. Um, plus maybe one or two others, we'll have to see how it goes. Um, Another regal that I had is commercial variety pack strawberries and cream. That's coming on and there are still a few more blooms to open on that. Hopefully in this warmth, it's maintaining the blooms that are still out. So that's the key for anybody showing um, uh, this year. I mean, it's one of the things is keeping the humidity down, which has now massively increased. Uh, so yeah, we just have to see how it goes. I have got a Gosbrook Susanna down there that I'm hopeful will be a bit better. He has got a few more blooms on it, but there's nothing like the punch um, that they do normally have. Um, I'm still hopeful of getting this really big boy to the show. Uh, this is a Steve Pollard unnamed plant. Um, I've been growing for a few years now. Uh, it's a really big standard, but I think that's going to look fairly impressive. Uh, lots of young standards here that are still going. Um, and that's just about it, really. Uh, I have got one or two others which I'm not going to partake and push through on this video. I've got some young standards here. This is Rushmore Bondi Blue. And that's going to be pretty decent in a year or two, I think. Uh, same as this one, um, Doris Shaw. This is a regal standard. But again, it's, well, it's very late like nearly all of my plants i was funnily enough discussing final stopping of regals yesterday and they can't believe that i stopped so late and i have to say that realistically i probably need to stop even earlier i may even think about stopping one or two of my regals 
um, <laughs> in the autumn this year prior to show because they are a little bit late. I know we've had an unusually cool spring, um, but we'll just have to see how it goes. Right, so I'm going to call it a day there. I want to get in the house before this storm really gets going. Um, so I'll just leave you with the best in show at the Bristol Pelagonium show yesterday. Rushmore, Jan Wilson, which did very well for me. So I'll see you again very soon. I'll see you after the show. Lots of PAGS content will be, um, will be coming up, of course, on YouTube, on the YouTube PAGS channel, the Pelagonium and Geranium Society channel. Uh, and I'll also be doing a supplementary magazine for the members this year. Um, a magazine which will feature lots and lots of pictures of all of the uh, sort of top three plants. So that's something to look forward to. Uh, so there we go. That's it from me for now. And I'll see you again very, very soon after the show season.